Younger Dryas, Noah's Ark 7000-Year Turnover Event by Hybrids to Cradle and Civilization. Abstract. This is about our claim that to solve our challenges and to achieve quality of life and existence we need to know our origin and its practices which include sustainable carbon agroforest practices in the Americas, that are at least in part and for a certain period of time taken with them and practiced during their voyages to their cradles and in their destinations. That is because our existence depends on us acquiring again the lifestyle our ancestors practiced and which made them thrive and expand and rendered them stable DNA. To some extent the maintenance of stable DNA, even while they were hybrids that typically feature less stable DNA, also helped the ancestors of modern humans, but in particular certain groups, Y-DNA haplogroup R, to turn over significant part of the world, and to ultimately kind of dominate the planet, monopolar. Nevertheless, it is important to be aware it is hybridized DNA and it is less stable than for instance the hybridized DNA of certain indigenous people and or older haplogroups, ancient populations. That is one more reason we need to know who our ancestors are and what paths we followed, including the transoceanic ones. Several videos about these paths and hybridization are available on this channel and related channels. Therefore we will have to use the info we humans gathered from ancient DNA and respect and learn from scientific markers and respect them, we often do not, because what they teach us is quite often inconvenient for long-term existing consensus and dogmas. Most of the featured thumbnails and images will be illustrated, covered and referenced in other videos of this series, Channel Origin for Existence and or A, in related channels like Climax for Existence, referring to primary forests or Climax forests and Climax agroforests alike. All videos and channels are in function of and promoting a global plan for existence that also includes necessary existing centers and models. This while one particular Y-DNA haplogroup R is most associated with the conquests around 1500 expansions afterwards, Christianism as well as the UN alliance that made the world monopolar. The stability of that stable DNA became gradually, but often stepwise, less stable, and this yet again roughly since 1995 with a peak around 2020 which could put into question all the above stable DNA and stable environment. While there is plenty of scientific evidence the origin of all modern humans lies in the Americas, there is evidence for a lot of possibly, because of interests, deliberate distraction that made we did not yet recognize this evidence. In this context Noah's Ark is an abstract of a 7,000-year population turnover event, David Rye, Ancient DNA, Out of Americas, Amerindians, by Hybrids, that illustrates how we abandoned these sustainable lifestyles and the related knowledge, and destroyed our soils and consequently our climate as well as the stability of our DNA. Engineer Johannes Morlantz and Think Tank Team, PDB Safe Haven, Model and Destination, RN, Brazil. Thank you. This series will continue.